What is up, lab members and Steinskate fans? I'm going to adjust the camera just a little bit. Today we're looking at a huge machine, which does quite a little. Now, today we're looking at the Tombox. I think this is the 100 CD version. This big fan-looking device is actually a um, CD holder for your CDs. It's quite useless, I'll tell you why. I'm not going to be bothered to turn it around because it's so big. The back is all, it's just all the black plastic, so it doesn't really matter anyway. But it is electronic. On the back there is a little power brick, which I've already plugged in. On the side there's an on and off switch, I'm going to turn it on, and it will have some lights. Now, you can't see the lights too well, but it does light up, as you can see right over there. And then here is a little number, or well, now it's two stripes. What this is meant to be is a, like I said, a CD holder, but not for your CD with your case, for the CD alarm. Uh, and then you put the cases, I suppose, in here. Maybe it's meant for your singles. I'm not very sure. The problem is with this thing is, and I'll show you, because it's it's a cool little machine. This thing entirely moved, but it's a 200 CD version, so it has can hold up to 200 CDs. This entire thing spins, right? And then this, you can see the number shows you which CD you're on, right? So we can put, put a CD in through, there's actually a CD in here, hold up. Yeah, there's a CD in here. You pull on it, CD goes out, Tupac's greatest hits, Outlaws. Um, actually, this is still our rise uh, with, with Tupac and Outlaws. But put it back in like that. You pull it back out again. This you pull towards yourself. Pulls this out. Pretty cool. Plus, the problem is, let's say I have this thing entirely filled up with CDs, right? look like that but then all around how do you know which one is which you can't even see the CD so what you need to do if you want to look if you want to know what CD you have or which one to get you need to have a big palm box binder now truth be told if I want to look some somewhere and I have my shelf I know top ones are this genre bottom ones are this genre and then I can look at the at the spine of the case, and it will tell me what CD it is. With this one, you'd have to look up an entire list of 200 CDs to then figure out, you know, which one's which. And even worse, what if you want to switch? Uh, what if we get a new one? You want to switch one out, or if you want to change, you know, their positions. You have to rewrite the entire goddamn book. It's absolutely insane. Here you can put some um. Cases, I suppose. But it is quite useless, isn't it? I mean, it works. If I put, turn the lights off, you can see it looks nice when it's lit up. That's for sure. But it is absolutely useless, I'd say. I'm actually going to take out the Outlaws one because it's quite cool. I'm going to keep it somewhere else because I don't want it to be in there. Here we go. Put this in here. But this is awesome yet yeah, so ridiculous. Take these out again. You pull. You move. You pull. Oh, it does make a, lo uh, a loud clicking noise. Clicking plays. And if you don't, if you want to go from you know fifty to to one hundred and fifty, you don't want to go. Sound is very loud, so you can hold these little things, or make a smooth transition, and it'll still show at the bottom which one you're on. And you can let go, like so. Very interesting, very useless. That makes it for this video, actually. It's all it is. Thought it was quite nice. I'm glad to have it in my collection, but I'm not not ever ever gonna use it. Sorry, there's that. Thank you guys for watching. See you in the next video. Erupsai kangalo.